You can learn more about many of the stories featured in this episode in the August issue of Mohawk Valley Living Magazine, available for free at over 200 local shops and restaurants, and anytime online at mohawkvalleyliving.com. The Steet Ponte Auto Group in Herkimer and Yorkville and Turnbull Insurance Service since 1866 present Mohawk Valley Living, exploring the arts, culture, and heritage of our region. Good morning and welcome to Mohawk Valley Living. We're traveling today all over the Mohawk Valley from Newport to Cooperstown and then here to Marcy to Jim McDermott's studio. So be sure to stay tuned. I've seen a lot from out of you bars in front of a dozen more. Through those times I never felt the struggle between love and war. Touched my heart in many ways I've never felt before. Honey, reconsider this as you walk out the door Cause I'll do anything for you Yes, I'd do anything for you If you ask me to swim the seven seas off by the crocodile I'll pull on my swimming trunk just to see you smile A regular feature in Mohawk Valley Living Magazine is Oneida County history. This month, we're remembering the revolution. Although nearly two and a half centuries have passed since the conflict, the revolution's legacy is all around us. I've written in the past before about how the American Revolution literally took place in our own backyard. And all you have to do is take a look around to some of the historic sites in the county to realize that the story of the American Revolution weaves itself intimately with the story of our local history. Uh, Fort Stanwix being perhaps the most prominent example, but also, of course, there's the Steuben State Historic Site in northern Oneida County. You can just go one county over to uh, General Herkimer's home as well. And, of course, the Oriskany Battlefield, which is uh, just a few miles away from where we're speaking. Uh, in addition to William Floyd, signer of the Declaration of Independence, and Baron von Steuben, the drill master of the Continental Army, of course we have General Nicholas Herkimer, uh, who led uh, Continental troops on um, uh, uh, a party that was intended to relieve Fort Stanwix during 1777. Uh, of course, they uh, met with uh, British troops at Oriskany uh, in August of 1777 but somebody who's interested in uh, Herkimer and his life and that event, a pivotal turning point in the 1777 offensive, can go from the Herkimer State Historic Site uh, all the way up to the Oriskany Battlefield and along the way uh, follow the Herkimer March markers. There are 14 of them all together that uh, tell the story of uh, Herkimer and his troops. Don't forget that you can read Mohawk Valley Living Magazine on your smartphone or tablet. It's also a great way to share the Mohawk Valley with friends and relatives outside the area. Oh, it's not what you take to give, it's here. The Steet Ponte Auto Group is proud to bring Mohawk Valley Living to you each week, serving the Utica area and the Valley with outstanding customer service. In Yorkville at Steet Ponte Ford Lincoln Mazda, Steet Ponte Volkswagen, and Steet Toyota Scion. And in Herkimer at Steet Ponte Chevrolet. Stop in and see why it's so easy to do business with Steet Ponte. You go the extra mile for your small business and should expect the same from your insurance company. For over 140 years, Turnbull Insurance Service has been committed to local small business. For your commercial coverage, turn to the company ready to go that extra mile. Turn to Turnbull. Melrose Supermarket is your family hometown market. Known for their choice hand-cut meats, homemade breads, and fresh pastas and salads. Check out the weekly specials at Melrose Supermarket, East Main Street in Frankfurt. Explore arts and culture in Madison County. Discover museums, art centers, galleries, and historical landmarks. Madison County, where past and present meet. Mark your calendars for the 10th annual Clinton Art and Music Festival, Saturday, August 29th, featuring all forms of art and all kinds of music. There are also children's activities, food, and fun at the 10th annual Clinton Art and Music Festival, Saturday, August 29th. 
Adirondack Furniture is having a bedding blowout sale. The best price is guaranteed. All in-stock and floor models reduced. Save 25 to 50% off in-stock and floor model Rustonic mattresses. Save 50% off remaining floor models and in-stock Tempur-Pedic mattresses. Take advantage of the lowest prices of the year on all custom American-made dining, bedroom, and occasional sets. Choose your style, wood, base, finish, and size. 0% financing available and free delivery up to 50 miles. Visit any of Adirondack Furniture's three convenient locations. Come explore the new Newport Marketplace Top Notch Garden Center, featuring over 40 vendors of antiques and vintage items. You'll also find all your garden needs at the new Newport Marketplace Top Notch Garden Center on Main Street in Newport. It may be hot outside, but transitional fall clothing is trickling in to the Village Crossing, including pretty cardigans from Avalon. The Village Crossing, West Park Row in Clinton. Buy the bushel and save at North Star Orchards. Take advantage of summer's bounty and stock up now for freezing and canning. Pick a pack of peppers. Choose from eight varieties. Enjoy sweet nectarines and peaches from New York and Pennsylvania. Buy the bushel and save at North Star Orchards in Westmoreland. Down the hill, down into the Mohawk Valley. Special thanks to Turnbull Insurance Service and Mark and Jim Turnbull. Their continued support makes the show possible. Don't let the summer go by without a visit to the Fenimore Art Museum in Cooperstown. The Thaw Collection of American Indian Art is celebrating 20 years. There are also painting workshops taking inspiration from museum exhibitions, like the popular Maxfield Parish Art of Light and Illusion. We had a wonderful time working for about the past three years, visiting art institutions, museums, libraries, and looking for Maxfield Parish works that would tell the story we wanted to tell. And what is that story? Well, we wanted to focus on Maxfield Parish, the painter, the illustrator, but we also wanted to give a unique perspective about how Parish created his work. And that's something you really don't hear about too often. Popular. Parish is so popular because he brings an amazing realism to subjects that are magical and fantastical. He makes them believable. At one point he says it's the unattainable that appeals. And you see that in all of the paintings here. There are faraway worlds that we would like to inhabit and Parrish makes them real for us. Don't miss Maxfield Parrish Art of Light and Illusion. Only here for a short time through September 7th at the Fenimore Art Museum in Cooperstown. Open daily 10 to 5 throughout the summer season. To see what we can see Traveling round the Mohawk Valley When traveling around Cooperstown, you can't miss the bright red arrows directing you to a new herb farm. High up on Tanner Hill Road, there is construction of a new herb shed overlooking Muskrat Pond. It is a dream realized by Catherine Mollock, who is returning to her farming roots. My family farmed cauliflower during the 40s and 50s and 60s, a little bit in the 70s. And uh, it's, uh, it, was a, it was a heyday. It was a heyday of activity. My brother was came back and did dairy farming for many years and now he sells his hay and uh, but I've taken up farming in the last four years. And tell us what your passion is. And my passion is herbs. I have always liked herbs for the last 20 years. I thought about this so it's been simmering on the back burner for many years and then all of a sudden I retired and became a widow and I said not now when. And tell me about That's where we're perfect, standing right. and what's going to be happening here. Soon. We are standing on what is called the shed. This is the shed. And it certainly looks like more than a shed, but uh, this is where I will sell from and have some tea parties and people can come and relax. My mission here was to have people come and be recreated, recreated. It's a recreational kind of vision in that people will relax and, and, and fall into nature. And I love it. I just love it. I, I couldn't be happier. I couldn't be a happier person. 
Tanner Hill Herb Farm is planning its opening sometime in late August. Visit our website, mohawkvalleyliving.com, for dates and times, or follow Tanner Hill Herb Farm on Facebook. Looking for a family adventure this summer? Head north of Herkimer on Route 28 to Ace of Diamonds Mine. People come from all over the country in search of Herkimer diamonds. As we speak, this beauty was uncovered by 11-year-old Abigail Duffy from Westchester County. Richard gears up to hunt for diamonds, but beware of diamond fever. Owner Ted Smith caught it when he was just a boy and hasn't got over it yet. Well, I've been here almost 52 years. I my dad had it before me and I worked my way through college selling crystals and I've done other things but I always keep coming back to the mine and historically it's been good to everybody. What we have here is the most clear quartz in the world. It's unique in the fact that it has a point on both ends of it where most quartzes, other areas in the world are, have a point on one end and it's just phenomenally clear. A lot of them are digging the crystals because they're, they believe in the crystal healing and then we still get a lot of rock collectors and then I sell a lot of crystals in Hong Kong for jewelry manufacturing. I still enjoy digging crystals. It's to find an exceptionally large clear crystal, it's just a high. Ace of Diamonds Mine is open daily 9 to 5 on Route 28, about 8 miles north of Herkimer. Outside the Old Grange on Route 291 in Marcy, sculptor Jim McDermott is busy at work creating large figurative sculptures out of giant hollow logs. The rhythms in the tree's form guide his hands, the tools of a sculptor that he discovered early on as a painter. Uh, uh, when almost my senior year in um, college, and what happened is that I have a bachelor's degree, I studied painting, but all the while I'd work, my hands were, uh, were my tool. And uh, um, the chainsaw, uh, work in construction, I did high work at one time, uh, working on steeples, chimneys, uh, you name it. And, uh, but it's always the idea that you have a kinship with labor and work. And, uh, and my sense now is to try and, uh, and find importance in what I'm doing. When I see something, it, uh, I feed on it. And it usually becomes a human idea. Uh, if it's a female form, I try to find out why that's, uh, why the figure is still a valid subject in a day when people say the figure is dead, you know, in art. And uh, I also don't follow art schools like, am I an abstract uh, anything, I don't know, expressionist or, or whatever, a post anything, I post myself. I have to do it. Uh, if you have to do it, you do, you know you're there. Visit the Fenimore Art Museum's new exhibition, Maxfield Parish, The Art of Light and Illusion. Enjoy 45 rarely seen original paintings, sketches, and fantastic prints by one of America's most popular 20th century artists. Marvel at his magical fairy tale images and idyllic landscapes. The Fenimore Art Museum overlooking Otsego Lake in Cooperstown. Great American art in a beautiful setting. For more information, visit FenimoreArtMuseum.org. 
The Steet Ponte Auto Group is proud to bring Mohawk Valley Living to you each week, serving the Utica area and the Valley with outstanding customer service. In Yorkville at Steet Ponte Ford Lincoln Mazda, Steet Ponte Volkswagen, and Steet Toyota Scion. And in Herkimer at Steet Ponte Chevrolet. Stop in and see why it's so easy to do business with Steet Ponte. Mark your calendars for the 10th annual Clinton Art Music Festival Saturday, August 29th, featuring all forms of art and all kinds of music. There are also children's activities, food and fun at the 10th annual Clinton Art and Music Festival Saturday, August 29th. Welcome to the Little Falls Antique Center in the shops at 25 West. Come on in and browse thousands of unique items that change on a daily basis. Shop for yourself or for someone else. We're open every day from 10 to 5. We look forward to your visit here at Historic Canal Place in Little Falls. Tom's Natural Foods is your connection to local farms for natural and organic fruits and vegetables, meats, eggs, cheeses, and other milk products at Tom's Natural Foods in Clinton, naturally. The people you know, the rock you love, and more songs per hour. 92.7 FM, The Drive, Central New York's locally owned independent rock station. Few places bring the past and present together like the Farmer's Museum in Cooperstown. Recently named one of the top 10 places where history comes to life by Good Morning America. Each weekend, costumed actors portray 19th century characters. Learn from knowledgeable interpreters. Ride the Empire State Carousel. Visit animals on the working farm. There's fun for the whole family. Step back in time at the Farmer's Museum in Cooperstown, New York. Our next stop is the Herkimer County Historical Society on North Main Street in Herkimer on the historic four corners that include the 1834 Herkimer County Jail. This historic building, its artifacts, and its famous former inmate, Roxalana Drews, inspire many stories and research. Roxalana was known as Roxy and she became famous because she murdered her husband in 1884 down in the town of Warren and her children, helped, two of her children helped out, a nephew. Roxalana Drew shot her husband, and then she went one step further. She had some, one of the boys go out and get an ax, and they chopped him up and burned him in the parlor stove. And Roxy was found guilty in 1887. She was sentenced to die by hanging on February 28th in the yard of the jail out back and she was the last woman hung in New York State, and this was February 28th of 1887. And we're going to be doing a play called Roxy in association with the Ilian Theater Club. Now, uh, Roxy's interesting to do a play because not it's a unique murder. Um, I don't know of too many others in New York State with uh, chopping up your husband and burning him in a parlor stove. Like Sweeney Todd. Yeah, <laughs> Sweeney Todd. <laughs> so, yeah, it's uh, something we... Actually, my uh, Carol Hobson that works with me approached Jack Sherman, who was involved with the uh, Chester Gillette play, and asked him if he would write a script for us. And so he agreed to do it. It's been a few years, and it finally has all come together, and it's going to really happen. We're so excited about it happening. It's a fundraiser for the society. Get your tickets now for Roxy. On stage the weekends of September 11th and 12th and 18th and 19th at the Illion Little Theater in Illion. Tickets available for sale at the Herkimer County Historical Society at 400 North Main Street in Herkimer. We first visited Ma's Farm on the West Canada Creek in Newport a few years back, when Wendy and her husband Michael moved to the area from Rushland, Pennsylvania. Now they have a busy farm store and two little ones with another on the way. We follow Wendy, Anna Lee, and Little Truly out into the fields to bring in another harvest of fresh natural vegetables. Anna Lee may be in a dress, but she's all business, a serious little farmer in the making. We try and grow everything during the summer that you would want to buy at the grocery store and hopefully a little bit more than that. I mean, we, we really want to make it everything you want, you know, uh, 
everything from lettuce and tomatoes and cucumbers to make a salad to, you know, uh, cabbage to make your sauerkraut in the fall. We have a new high tunnel that we just put up and um, this year we're doing some late season tomatoes in it. And it's uh, really a greenhouse that um, you grow right in the soil, um, not in pots or anything like that. It, so you get all the nutrients right from the soil to make everything taste better. Well, here we're just trying to make it so that it supports uh, the whole family and we don't have to go get off farm jobs and we keep ourselves busy through the winter with the chickens and the pigs and the cows and um, we can keep some income coming in all winter long. So we have Anna Lee and Truly here and there are two children at the moment and we have another one on the way and hopefully uh, they get to spend all their days here with us. <laughs> I'll never be alone Making this family my home I'm so proud to call it my home It's not what you take but For lunch, we head to East Main Street in Westmoreland to Knucklehead's Brew House, a popular place to get out of the heat and enjoy some good home barbecue. The Adirondack atmosphere, generous portions, and friendly service make it a local hotspot. But it's chef Mark Schwenk's home cooking that keeps people coming back for more. Well, I've been here for closing in on seven years. Uh, Knucklehead's is a little different than a lot of the places around here. Everybody talks about taverns, and they think of tavern food. Knucklehead's isn't really a tavern, it's a restaurant with a bar in it. So we've probably got one of the more extensive menus that you'll find anywhere in the area. Uh, we have everything. We have a full menu for children, uh, chicken fingers for kids, burgers, hot dogs, macaroni and cheese. Uh, for We've got a huge barbecue section for what we've got going on in the summer. We have wood smoked brisket that we do. Every Saturday night we do a wood smoked prime rib here, which is phenomenal. I mean, really good stuff. Uh, you had a Carolina pulled pork yes, that you tried today. Yes, secret. <laughs> well, can't tell you that. No, it's it's a special sauce that we have. It's a Carolina style sauce with the, with uh, coleslaw on top of the pork. Really nice uh, as far as that goes. Uh, of course, and then there's the chief sandwich, which one you had also, which is that's really the big sandwich here. Anybody who likes Philly cheesesteak sandwiches is going to love a chief. That's it's tremendous. Well, I enjoy it here. Uh, this place, I've worked. In other words, I literally worked on Miami Beach over the ocean. And this has been my favorite restaurant to be in so far because it's really like a family around here. Uh, everybody around here is so friendly with each other and everybody cares about everybody that comes in here. We try to make it a really good experience. For Traveling round the Mohawk Valley, let's see what we can see. It's time. When planning your family's future, turn to the principles of the past. Turn to Turnbull. Turnbull Insurance Service is an independent agency representing the most dependable companies for all your insurance needs as well as complete financial planning and wealth management. Call today for a free assessment. Adirondack Furniture is having a bedding blowout sale. The best price is guaranteed. All in-stock and floor models reduced. Save 25 to 50% off in-stock and floor model Rustonic mattresses. Save 50% off remaining floor models and in-stock Tempur-Pedic mattresses. Take advantage of the lowest prices of the year on all custom American-made dining, bedroom, and occasional sets. Choose your style, wood, base, finish, and size. 0% financing available and free delivery up to 50 miles. Visit any of Adirondack Furniture's three convenient locations. Come explore the new Newport Marketplace Top Notch Garden Center, featuring over 40 vendors of antiques and vintage items. You'll also find all your garden needs at the new Newport Marketplace Top Notch Garden Center on Main Street in Newport. When you shop Meelan's Market, you'll be the grill master. That's because every hot dog, beef patty, and sausage is made by Bob Meelan himself. Find everything for your next cookout from store-made meats to fresh salads and tabbouleh at Meelan's Market at the Four Corners in Clark Mills. 
I, R.A. Dudrak, the Window King, invite you to visit our showroom in Holland Patent, or we'll come to your home by appointment. We've been installing replacement windows for over 45 years. Keep your palace cool in the summer and warm in the winter by adding new windows. Many styles and selections to choose from. Bay, bow, garden, and double hung, single hung, and slider windows. The Window King also introduces color replacement windows. So take a short drive to R.A. Dudrak, Holland Patent, and tell them the Window King sent you. Expecting company? Just call Deansboro Superette. They prepare delicious Middle Eastern platters for any number of guests. Call 841-4377. Visit Brenda's Natural Foods in their brand new, bigger location, right down the street at 236 West Dominic Street in Rome. Brenda's Natural Foods. Something good and a lot of it. Those Sundays at home. It's been a Now that you can't get corn any fresher than that, we're all looking to enjoy the corn as it comes in uh, from the fields, but also to put some away for the fall and later in the winter when it really tastes good to you. Uh, one of the tips I've always advised people is to maybe instead of doing a big batch of corn to freeze, is do micro um, batches. Every time you have corn, take two or three extra years cut them off, put them in a baggie, put them in the freezer, and by the end of the fall, when corn's done, you're gonna have half your freezer filled with it. New York is still one of the largest producers of peaches, and you're gonna see all kinds of peaches, even these donut peaches, which are a little milder, easier to eat. Um, try all the different ones. All the growers are adding new varieties, white peaches, the red peaches, the red bean on the inside, so when you cut them in half, you get that nice red blush when you put them in a jar. After the cool nights we've been having throughout the summer, which make great sleeping, we're back into the, the heat throngs of August and, and when everything starts ripening up. And nothing likes the heat better than tomatoes. But obviously, you're, it's the start of the, the season. You're going to see peppers coming on next. Plenty of tomatoes, peppers, beans are, are starting to really come in, all different kinds. Um, so it's the start of where we're going for fall. Oh, got a head like a bean. But he steers a tea. 